No, just the one more's millions this week. And for some reason, it's a four mile version. And it's a 0 to 140 and Tom on his slow burner for Leon van Rensburg. Stay all day. Craig Beckwith, Midget Camera, David Robertson, Charlie 2, and Sunday Mott for Thomas Rogers, De Banshaman, Alex Cherry, Emma's Legend, February, Graham Clutterbuck, Balance Junior, Kevin Mead, and Born to Perform, Stu Gray, River Tyne for David Robertson, Verge for James Shea, Crossmaster, John Morgan, Cart and Tantalus for Hems, Thistledown, Please for Daniel French, Rizwan Calling, Graham Clutterbuck, Inga Bird, Darren Thompson, Lady Sink, Martin Leadham, Not Now, Never, James Shea, Zinc for Kevin Minahan, Simple Dutch Paul O'Neill, Yavari featured Darren Thompson, Maldon's Mirage, Martin Leadham, Tambara, Paul Rhodes, Southern Spectrum, Alex Cherry, Fifi, Paul Rhodes and Conno for Paul Fisk. So, big field then. And away they go. I think this is the longest race of the week. And probably the only four miles. That's why there's so many in it as they get to the first. And... They're all safely over the first. We should see some thrills and spills and action in this one then. And stay all day. He's in the lead. From Cartan Tantalus. Those two normally like to go on. Sorting themselves out as they get to the second. One or two really wide of a trap. Once run around the side of that fence. And they're all over it okay. And Alex Cherry will be hoping his horse can cut in. A little bit southern spectrum it's going really wide one or two of those others are as well including Cono and um i think that's Morden's mirage the gray and the purple jacket they sort of get into more of a regulation racing pack now and sort of themselves out as they swing left-handed and stay all day he's the leader cartan tantler second gap off Four or five lengths then to the third place horse Sunday Mott. Then Midget Camera and Yavari feature and Tambar after that one as they take this ditch. And they're all over that one okay as well. Here's the Southern Spectrum, the back marker. Over the fourth of the 24. A mistake by Muldoon's Mirage at the back. And stay all down cards and Tantalus are disputing the lead. And they are a good six or seven lengths clear. So they take the next. Jumping's been pretty good so far. Maldon's Mirage at the tail end, Charlie, at the moment. As they get to the sixth. And we've lost one there. That's the first fall up. Crossmaster's gone. So Crossmaster is out of the race. And Cartan Tantalus has taken the lead. And Cartan Tantalus in front then from a stay all day second. And two of these are still pretty wide on the track. Six or seven horses wide. Including the Kevin Meadahan horse there. I think that one is, is Zinc. He's got two. Now they pass the winning post with a couple more circuits to go. And Cartan Tantalus will be hoping to pass that winning post in the lead three times. And he's in front at the moment from a stay all day second. The Grey Lady Sink has moved into third, but he's wide on the track. So the jockey will be hoping to cut across a little bit. Looks like he is doing it. Field may just bunch up a little bit here as they come around this pretty sharp turn. And Cartan, Tantalus and stay all day. Get back to Tambar in third. Sunday Mott is fourth. Then Lady Senk on the outside. Verge on the inside of that one as they get to the seventh. Oh, and he's gone there. Stay all day. Crashed into that fence and he's out of it. Pretty sure that one did something similar when it was in the lead last week as well. But Cartan, Tantalus has been left eight lengths clear. Of oh, Lady Senk who's in second. And Tambar on the inside is third as they get over the next. Over that one, okay. And Cartan Tantalus looks to front run. Got no company though. Uh, he takes that one. Uh, they're all over that one, okay, with Emma's Legend February, just the back marker. Cartan Tantalus is in front. The fence is coming up thick and fast. This is the tenth. One or two nodded there. Charlie 2 didn't jump it all that well. As they race towards the 11th. Once again, one or two slow jumps. Not now, never was particularly slow at the back. But all the remaining winners are still on their feet. A few fences. Just lost Crossmaster and stay all day so far. And Cartan Tundless lead is now down to four lengths. With Lady Sink second, Yavari feature third, then Midget Cameron, Debancher Man. After that one, then Sunday Mott, Fifi, 
Tambora. And Virgin Slow Burner. Cartan Tantalus is continuing to lead. Oh, about four. Two Yavari feature lady sinking midget camera as they come to this ditch. Oh, there's another fall there. Somebody else has gone. Born to perform has gone. So Stu's back in the league with just a couple of horses. And Born to perform did okay last week, but he's out of the race this week. So. Bad luck there, Stu. And Cartan Tantalus is the leader. Over that next one they go. And now the 15th. Miss Legend February didn't jump it too well. They're coming up then past the stand shortly. And Cartan Tantalus will lead them past the winning post for the second time. And as they begin to go on their final circuit of the track, then it's Cartan Tantalus who's in the lead. Lady Senk is second. Midget Camera. On the inside of that one is third. Yavari Feature is four, and Debanchaban is five. Then Simple Dutch is six, and then Slow Burner and Fifi, and then Zinc, and then Tambara dropping back a bit, and then Rizwan, Colin, and Charlie Two, and Sunday Mott, and then Inga Bird and River Tyne, and then Balance June, Thistledown, Please, Verge, Not Now, Never, Muldoon's Mirage has been on at the back all the way, so too Southern Spectrum, Kono, and finally Emma's Legend, February. Cartan Tantalus. Lead down to just one length now. Uh, as Lady Sink and Midget Camera close, they jump that next one. And they will stream over that one okay with Kono. The back marker in shot. Emma's Legend February is out of shot. Interesting thing about this race is in SO6. I think about five of these would have pulled up already as they come down to this ditch. And over that one they go. And we've lost one there as well. River Tyne's gone this time. So. River Tyne is out, but David Robertson's got another one, and it's in second place at the moment. Midget Camera on the inside of Lady Sink, they're chasing Cartan Tantalus. The Greys are in force at the leading part of the race with Zinc and Simple Dutch also up there. As they get over the next one, oh, and the leader made a mistake, he hit that one hard. It's going to cost him a few lengths, and Lady Sink has now gone on. So Lady Sink is the new leader. From Midget Camera second, and Simple Dutch is third, Cartan Tantalus is now back to fourth, but jumped that one much better, Muldoon's Mirage trying to get a bit closer as well, but it's Lady Senk in the lead then, from Simple Dutch and Zinc, the three greys, then Cartan Tantalus on the inside, the Banshaman, Midget Camera, that's the leading group, Yavari Feature just tucked on the back of them, then come the Rhodes Bear, Tambar and Fifi trying to get into it, with Sunday Mott and Charlie too, and Slow Burn at the top weight, He's on the inside, running a quiet race. Lady Sink from long time leader Cartan Tantas. Look at this around the outside. Thistle down, please. Come from absolutely nowhere to sweep into the lead now. This is the fourth last. And Thistle down, please. Landed in front from Cartan Tantas, the second. And then Lady Senk is third. Then comes Midget Camera Zinc de Bancherman Simple Dutch. This is the third last. Over that one they go and Cartan Tantalus is getting back up on the inside. This all down, please. These two from Midget Camera and Lady Senk, who looks a little bit one pace as they race down towards the second last. Then this all down, please. Landed in the lead. Here comes Midget Camera to throw down a big challenge in second. They've only got one more fence to take. And this all down, please. Will come to win in the lead. Gets over it with a slow jump. Midget Camera now takes it up. And here comes de Bancherman from absolutely nowhere. It's Midget, Midget Camera from de Bancherman as they race into the final furlong. Midget Camera's in the lead. De Bancherman's trying to close. It's between these two as they race up towards the line. Now they've still got about half a furlong to go. De Bancherman on the outside. Midget Camera on the near side. It's going to be a head bob and it's one after four miles and they race up towards the line. Can Midget Camera hold on? Can De Bancherman get up? That's close. And it's very close. Car Cantantula stuck on to be third. The field of trail back to Fifi who was last. And... Man sat out in the back for most of the race. Don't think he's got up though. I think Midget Camera's won that. It's mighty close after four miles. It's 
take a look. It's Midget Camera by Shorthead for David Robertson. The Bunch of Hydraulics Cherry ran a great race in second. Carlton Tucklers for Hems also did really well in third. And Charlie 2 for Thomas Rogers was fourth. And Lady Sink stuck on to be fifth.